Hey there, it's Dr. Tawana with today's Friday quick tip video. Let's talk about how to set boundaries in networking without burning bridges. Networking is an important part of professional success, but it's also important to set boundaries. So here are my five tips for setting boundaries in networking without burning your bridges. One, know your limits. What are you willing to do in terms of time, energy, and commitment? Once you know your limits, you can start to set boundaries accordingly. Two, be honest and direct. When someone asks for something that you are not willing to do, be upfront and honest about it. Don't beat around the bush or make excuses. I received a quest, request to be a reference from a former coworker. She asked me to pretty much lie about her qualifications for a job she'd applied for. I was clear and direct with my resounding no. The world of work can easily get very, very small, and I wasn't willing to sacrifice my reputation. Three, be respectful. Even if you're saying no to someone, be respectful of their time and their request. Explain why you're not able to help them and offer to connect them with someone else who might be able to. Four, be consistent. Once you start setting boundaries, be consistent with them. If you say no to someone once and then you turn around and say, okay, yes, the next time, it gets confusing and it's difficult to maintain boundaries at that point. Five, be willing to walk away. If someone doesn't respect your boundaries, be willing to simply walk away from the conversation or the relationship. Your time and energy are valuable and you shouldn't waste them on people who don't respect you. Setting boundaries in networking can be challenging, but it's important to do so in order to protect your time and your energy and your well-being. By following these tips, you can set boundaries without burning bridges and build healthy, productive relationships. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave a comment below.